There are several tourist attractions in the Silte Zone, including the Ainagi Cave located in Kabat City. It is believed that the cave is several centuries old. There is a religious man named Sheikh Muhammad who lives in that cave. The Sheikh said he prefers living in a quiet place talking to Allah rather than being surrounded by the noise of the city. According to the legend, the cave was once inhabited by another Sheikh who was ordered by Allah to live in there. I don't know. I don't know. تاریک اون بزو سو سرش نت علو تاریخ موزگوار. This cave has countless stories attributed to human creation, but in reality, uh, it is the work of Allah, the Creator of the heavens and the earth. It is Allah who made this cave. And while there are many forms of knowledge and creative works in the world, Allah's creation is unique and unparalleled. This cave is a testament to Allah's magnificent craftsmanship and power. Allah said, My son, you have wounded from place to place, from desert to desert, proclaiming that you will serve me. Now, I will provide you with a place to rest. So, Allah created the cave that you see before you here. He commanded the walls to form on the left and the right sides and ordered the stones to be covered inside. After that, Allah brought Sheikh Hussein to the cave and instructed him to serve him. For 70 years, Sheikh Hussein remained a dedicated servant of Allah in this cave. Allah provided him with water dripping from the dry stone and fulfilled all his needs. I was born here, but I did not know much about this place, and people did not know much about it either. The situation before my arrival was that people used to gather from different places, bringing cat, coffee, and water to make dua or prayer, where Nur Hussein Hyde rested. I was just in this kind of situation, and then Allah brought me here and kept me. Allah said to me, Come, I need you. I made this cave for my beloved servant before. Now you will start living here and serve me. At that time, the road was all through the forest and it was paved later. He brought me here and kept me alone for seven years. And the seven years passed without me even noticing. And of course, Allah blessed me with a family. I have now been living here for the last 37 years. It's hard. When people hear about this place from others who have come here and visited me before, they find it hard to believe. But when they see it for themselves, they'll be surprised. <laughs> Uh, I have no farm or land. Actually, I don't need the things of the outside world. The things in this world are not enough. People are always fighting. Therefore, 
I'm here with the support of Allah and I desire nothing but to be with him. I don't need anything else. I have no permission to leave this place, for it was Allah's will that brought me here and placed me here. Even if there are many buildings and everything outside, I don't need that. I leave all that for you. Let me go.